Welcome back to part three of trying out cheesy chips and wine pairings. Wine enthusiasts came out with their top recommendations in this series. We're trying each of them. Today, we are looking at goldfish, those little beloved crackers, and Prosecco. This is one of their recommendations together. Prosecco is a sparkling wine. And so we're gonna try five different flavors of goldfish with this Prosecco. Now I also happen to find a little baby Prosecco, which is just adorable version of the big guy. So we'll save this to when I have uh, other drinking partners and today we'll use this little guy. First up, we're gonna try what I think they probably were beginning with. It's just the regular cheddar goldfish cracker. These are, these are, you know, Tried and true, look at that little guy. I'm pretty sure almost everybody's had one of these. You actually don't swirl sparkling wine. That's nice. I wouldn't say overpowering. Does complement really well. Let's see how the other flavors do. Up next we'll move to flavor blasted extra cheddar. In case the first cheddar wasn't enough for you, not enough for me. So these guys look the same, maybe a little bit more powdery. I don't know. It is a, <laughs> it is a stronger cheese. Okay. It's better. It's better partly because just stronger cheese flavor on these guys. It does complement really well. Uh, the wine pairs really nicely, but uh, I would say the wine is stronger than uh, what we've had so far. And so this would be a really nice pairing, but let's see if some of these other flavors pack a little bit more of a punch. Sticking with the last of our cheese specific options, we have Parmesan. And so these are uh, noticeably different. These are uh, white in color. See this little guy, different cheese. Still not super strong, but a different, different cheese flavor. I think that one might be the best so far. I like the Parmesan a lot. Really goes well with that. Again, just a very nice pairing together. All right, now we're moving on. We're out of just the cheese land. We're moving into other flavors. This is flavor blasted cheddar and sour cream. Let's see if that sour cream adds a real big twist in. So here you go. Mmm, okay. Definitely taste the sour cream there. That's my favorite so far. The sour cream and the cheddar adds a little bit more complexity to it. The wine is a nice pairing with it, but this is bringing more to the table. Finally, we get to flavor blasted, extra cheesy pizza. So not just extra cheesy, but now we're going with a little pizza flavor in there as well. These guys are, are the most like vibrant color. They're kind of like uh, multicolor. Got some like red seasoning on an orange little guy there, okay. Definitely getting the pizza cracker vibe in addition to the cheese. It does taste like cheese pizza. Okay, this one is probably the strongest of all of them. I can continue to taste the cracker even after uh, I take a sip of the wine, which the only other one I could even partly do that with was the sour cream. So this is definitely the strongest. All right, so my official verdict is yes, this is a great pairing. These crackers go really nicely with a glass of Prosecco. If you wanna really get the vibe, go for the stronger flavors, which add in something else, the sour cream, the pizza, those are the, the stronger goldfish crackers. Those flavors hold up a little bit better, so you get more of an exciting pairing together in your mouth. Cheers.